Hello and welcome to Psychic Moon Tarot Reading. So today I want to do a reading for you to find out when you will meet your future spouse. Okay, this is a quick reading to find out. When are you going to meet your future spouse? This is a very, very, very highly requested video. And we have three piles here. Let me quickly uh, pick three piles. Mm. Yeah, here we have three piles. What do you need to know about your future spouse? When specifically... When will you meet your future spouse? So we have three piles. Let me have pile number one first. Okay. Pile number one. This is your card. Okay. Pile number two. Please let me have a second card for pile number two. Pile number two. Okay, that's your card. When will you meet your future spouse? File number three. Okay. Three very different piles. Okay. Interesting. Let me show it to you one more time. So this is pile number one. Pile number two. And pile number three. Okay. You can pause the video here. Meditate on these three images and see which is the one that calls to you. When will you find, when will you meet your future spouse? So, let's begin with pile number one, okay? When will pile number one meet their future spouse? When will you meet your future spouse by number one? I see you will meet your future spouse in the beginning of... you know, um, in the beginning of fall season. So somewhere around September, I see that you guys will be meeting your future spouse, uh, sorry, future spouse by number one. That's it, Aunt Krista. So page of pentacles. I see that uh, for some of you, I see that you will be meeting your future spouse when you are going to you know start a new phase of your career okay it's for example you go into a training a new training and that's where you meet your future spouse for some i see that you will be going into a new institution to for higher educations and that's where uh, you are going to meet your future spouse uh, I see that you will be very, very, uh, you know, the, mo the like when you meet your future spouse, I see that you will be in a state where you are very anxious. Okay, you will meet them in, 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 a, in a state where you are not having enough sleep and you're very anxious. Okay, things um, you it's a phase that I see that when you have just started something new, probably you've just entered a new college or a new institution new uh, office new career something very new or maybe you've shifted to a new house for some of you it could be that too uh, you've just shifted to a new place you've just started new and uh, you're struggling to you know um, be comfortable you're struggling to make things work for you and that's the time that you will uh, meet your future spouse pile number one and there is a lot about, you know, financial stability. So I see that you will be on a new journey 
to your financial independence that's when you will uh, you know meet your future spouse and your future spouse is going to be an earth sign that that I, by the earth sign i mean uh, taurus virgo or capricorn okay and yeah that's it so that's what i see for you that's what uh when you will meet your future spouse okay pile number one i hope this was helpful let me know in the comment section if this made you smile and let's move to pile number two quickly so pile number two whoever chose this card let's find out when will you meet your future spouse okay pile number two When will you meet your future spouse? Pile number two. When will pile number two meet their future spouse? Oops. Okay. You will meet this person at a phase of your life when you are leaving something uh, unfulfilled. Okay. Something that you put a lot of emotions into. Something that you put a lot of time into didn't work out as you thought and you're moving out of that energy and that's when you will meet your future spouse and it could be for example i see that uh, you could be in a very long relationship with someone and it didn't quite work out and you leave this relationship and move away and that's when you meet your future spouse okay i see that um for some of you not for all but for some of, some of you, I see that this could be your childhood sweetheart. Okay. This person comes and comforts you in this phase of your life where you need emotional support. And that's how things start budding together uh, for you. For you both. Okay. This person is again a king of pentacles. This person is very giving, nurturing. And this person is an earth sign. Okay. Virgo, Taurus and Capricorn either of these signs it could be a moon sign or a sun sign so this person is going to give you a lot of emotional support you know this person is going to heal your heart uh, space it's going to heal uh, this person is coming into your life as your spouse to heal your emotions to heal your heart space something didn't work out and it left you very unfulfilled and feeling empty inside and that's when this person steps in into your life to fill that void and be for you forever okay very sweet reading and uh, this six of cups is about you know childhood pleasures genuine kindness um, genuine acts of uh, compassion and happiness and sharing joy okay this person was uh like when you are at this stage of your life when you feel unfulfilled and unhappy about something uh this person steps into your life to give you that simple pleasures simple joys and that touches your heart you know and that starts your relationship so very sweet reading a lot of yellows in your reading sunflowers and like how you see these yellow flowers a lot of bright happy cute energy here so that was your reading pile number two. Let me know in the comment section if this made you smile and made you feel happy. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. If you're watching me for the first time, I'm here to do uh, spirit messages every day. And also uh, detailed readings on different topics uh, of life. And so consider subscribing to my channel and hit the, uh, the the bell button so that you are notified every time I post a new video, okay? Hit the like button too if you like this video and it will help me a lot. So moving on, pile number three for whoever chose this beautiful little birdie. That's your reading, okay? So pile number three, when will you meet your soulmate, your future spouse? when are you going to meet your future spouse when is pile number three going to meet their future spouse pile number three wow you will meet your future spouse for sure in a party okay 
uh, you will meet them in a very very fun setting you will meet them probably in a in a uh, you know in a very party kind of an ambience uh, probably you, you you will go with your friends i see like fun and frolic with friends celebrating seeing cheers you know having a night out with friends and that's when you meet your future spouse okay very beautiful energy uh i see this time to be october like the second half of the year that's the time when you will meet your future spouse um yeah and it will hit off right from the first meeting okay you will uh like the connection will like take off right from the moment you guys meet beautiful it's like oh my god it, it, it can't be like clearer the moment you look at each other let me hold them so that you can see the moment you look at each other you have that clarity okay the moment you see each other you will have that clarity that this is the one okay you will know instantly that this is the one pile number three very beautiful energy again i see that this person is an earth sign so either you are an earth sign or this person is an earth sign but i see um like a lot of earth sign people you know um, getting into relationships this year this person is going to value you a lot and this person is going to be very very faithful and truthful to you from right from day one they'll not hide their feelings okay this is not someone who will hide their feelings play around this person will be very clear and very very uh very clear about their uh, you know materialistic desires and everything like how they want their family how do they look at a married life how do they want this relationship to flourish all that they'll have very clear conversations with you so that was uh, your reading pile number 3 and answering your question when will you meet your soulmate your uh, future spouse okay so let me know in the comment section if this resonated if this made you happy it made you smile and i will see you very soon in some other pick up pile reading okay till then take care bye bye